Um, my position here is as a postdoctoral research fellow and I'm responsible for coordinating primarily two research studies. One looking at the link between obstructive sleep apnea, obesity and acid reflux and the other one looking at the effect of sleep apnea on cellular ageing. So obstructive sleep apnea um, is characterised by the airway collapsing while a person's asleep and this can happen up to or more than a hundred times an hour during the night. Um, people are generally very tired during the day, they fall asleep whilst driving, have problems uh, remembering things, um, they may wake up in the middle of the night choking with like a sensation that they can't breathe and quite often they will snore very loudly. It's been shown previously that people who have sleep apnea tend to have more acid reflux than people who don't have sleep apnea. There's a well-known correlation between sleep apnea and obesity, um, obesity being the main risk factor for sleep apnea. Um, that's been shown in a lot of studies beforehand. What we're mainly looking at here is, I guess, complications associated with obesity and sleep apnea. We're halfway through our data collection in Oklahoma City here, so we don't really have definitive findings yet. Um, one of my PhD studies back in Australia was looking at I guess how many people in the population have symptoms of reflux compared to people who have sleep apnea. And we found that up to three times more people with sleep apnea will have things like heartburn and regurgitation than people who don't have sleep apnea. Well, sleep apnea is associated with uh, many disorders, some of them being high blood pressure, heart failure, diabetes. So what we're looking at is, does having sleep apnea cause your body to age faster than, you know, than it would if you didn't have sleep apnea. There was a paper published earlier this year by another group who found that, um, that people with sleep apnea seem to age faster than those without, but that was the first study looking into that. So we're not, we're not quite sure just yet.